Hello everybody and welcome to Real and Virtual Outdoors. This is Thursday's live stream, the 16th day of June 2022. I'm at the computer changing the thumbnail and as soon as I get that changed I'll be in front of the camera and we're going to get ready and go for today's stream. We are going to be playing the Catch Carbon Course. <clears throat> uh, river catfishing on the Ubu River in Spain today. This was a requested live stream. Uh, the runner up to the poll winner that I put on the Real and Virtual Outdoors group page. The Hunter won for Tuesdays, and this come in second, so we're doing it today. All right, the thumbnail has changed, and I'm ready to get in front of the camera, and we're going to see about boat a couple of catfish today. <clears throat> all right, all right, all right. Kelly Bullock is in first. Hello, Kelly. <clears throat> Chris Everett. Okay. So. Quiet man, Curtis. Hello, Curtis. <coughs> All right. <coughs> Ryan Smith. Hello, sir. You'll have to forgive me if I cough a little bit. Up. It's getting better, but I still got to cough. All right. So we're going to. This will be over in two hours. Y'all go watch Kelly fish in two hours. Uh, the Bullock Experience. If you're not part of the Real and Virtual Outdoors group page, please join over there. I always put notifications up ahead of time uh, because PlayStation 4 will not let us do uh, pre-notifications. Uh, do not have that option, so I always put it on the group page. That's why it's always important to have the notification bell turned on so you know when I pop up. <clears throat> okay, this is a rendition of the Ebu River, and we're going to get in the boat. And uh, we're going to head on down to the bridge. <clears throat> if I can figure out where it's at. Okay, so let me show you the setup we've got here. <clears throat> we have uh, 12 foot rods, spinning reels. Uh, these rod and reels I bought with uh, end point tackle money, in game tackle money. I have 40 pound braid, which is the biggest line. I got <coughs> catfish pellets on one pole and mackerel and a whole roach on the other pole. So, that's what we got. <clears throat> We're going to board the boat here. And I think if I'm not mistaken, that bridge is up here. I'm going to take a little boat ride. Actually, we're going to be going down here. This boat's a little slow. Uh, I think they could give us a little bit better boat. But <clears throat> compared to the uh, bass boat that's on uh, Bass Bass 2022, this little old boat's pitiful. I 
I just hope we're going the right way. I have a feeling we're not. If I don't see it here in just a second, we'll fast travel back. Nope, we're going the wrong way. <coughs> I was afraid of that. I guess I should have got in the uh, boat and went and checked it out yesterday. Hello, Chrissy. Appreciate everybody coming in. We're gonna go back down here and see if we can find this bridge. If we don't, we're gonna pick a spot out to fish. Dale Hayslow. Thank you for coming in, Dale. Okay. So what we're going to do is we're going to go up here. And that was not it either, so I think it's in this other arm. But we're going to stop up here in front of this building just to the left and throw out some lines. I've had some success here and caught some uh, wheels catfish here. I'll get right up here where we're going to start. I thought I knew where that bridge was at. I guess I was mistaken, but... Should have got in the boat. Took a ride and looked. Okay, so we're going to start in right in here. Is where I want to start. Right on this point. Uh... I've caught some wheels catfish right here, so let's uh let's throw this out and see what we've got to work with. <laughs> okay. Catfish pellets is gonna be the first one. These basically catch channel cats pretty much. Uh you're not gonna see a wheels on this probably. Uh, there's one rod out. This is the whole mackerel on rod two. And this is a whole roach on rod three. And we're gonna cast this on out here, right in here. This is a long distance casting rod. <clears throat> All three of these rods cast a long way. Okay. <coughs> now we just sit back and wait. <clears throat> we'll put that a little spot rod. This has got uh, feed in it, pack bait. I'll throw it out there. It, this, <clears throat> it does dissolve. You can actually see it dissolving, uh, dissolving on top of water. If it's close enough. Okay, that's dissolved. We'll throw another one out here. Usually this trigger is a pretty good bite, pretty quick. I don't know what you mean by rod poop. <laughs> Do a little pre-baiting here. We also have a throwing stick. These are uh, boilies. I'm going to throw some of these out as well. You should have actually heard that hit the water.
these uh, tools that I'm using here are big over in Europe. This throwing stick is big over in Europe. And so is the spot stick. I use them for baiting carp. Steve Block, hello, sir. Appreciate everybody coming in. <laughs> yeah, I, I tell you what, I, I wish I had about <clears throat> wish I had about three more rods, but they give <coughs> give us a maximum of three. <clears throat> Again, y'all have to forgive me if I'm coughing. I I'm can't do much about it. Uh This is the, uh, they come out with Fishing Sim World first. Actually, they come out with Euro Fishing first, and then Fishing Sim World. This was the in-between game between Sim World and Bass Masters 2022. This is what they refer to as a dead game. There will be no further updates or anything done to this game, which is a disappointment <coughs> because it's well-loved by a lot of people and it's really well represented and loved over in the European community uh, and I enjoy it uh, a lot it's probably one of my favorite games to play oh Art <clears throat> Ernie hello Uh, I want to congratulate Art and the Wonton Fishing Club on being sponsored. That's a great thing when somebody sponsors you and recognizes your work. Congratulations to my friend Art and the Wonton Fishing Club. <coughs> okay, we wait. That's all we can do is wait. And if we don't get a bite, we'll move on down the river. Yes, it was. I'm grateful that it happened to a good group of people. It's uh, nice when somebody recognizes your efforts. Yes, sir. I'm proud to hear that. We're going to team up one of these days, Ernie, and do a little hunting. I am going to buy an Xbox as soon as my wife gets back off the trip. Probably will be not this weekend, but next I will go purchase that. Yeah, I heard. I saved the video. That was charged you $8 for a rod, and you're like, hey, something's wrong here. <laughs> yeah. I watched the the video. <coughs> I'm so sorry. Uh, Irony, we get get that Xbox. Uh, not this weekend, but next. And I'm gonna go ahead and sign up for Game Pass. And one way or the other, if you don't have Game Pass or something, we're gonna get you signed up so we can do a little hunting together. Uh. I looked on uh, uh, the uh, Game Pass website yesterday. Uh, so, and see what they had to offer as far as this game and uh, Fish and Sim World. They offer them both. So, uh, maybe you can get one of these games or maybe you might get a surprise and be able to get one so we can play together I need some adults to play with and uh, enjoy conversations with uh -uh. we're gonna let Mr. Kelly Bullock host on his channel sometime me and him and Aaron 
I'll try to get together and do a stream. Aaron from Catfish Regulators on uh, Fish and Sim World. He can do it through StreamYard. He's already got the setup, so I'd say he's been having to bother with it. We can all free link up and <clears throat> I look forward to it. Uh, I haven't played a lot of multiplayer stuff because uh, <clears throat> there's a <clears throat> hard to find a good good group to play with we'll wait a little bit this is a slower stream and uh, there's a fish than the hunting but that's all the catfish pellets okay we hooked up folks Might do. We'll try it here a minute. We'll be here for two hours today, Froggy, so you're good. Y'all can always look at, see what time, how long we've been on at the top left hand. I think y'all could see that. Time elapsed. This is pretty good. Appreciate Miss Froggy coming in. Froggy enjoys the fishing stream more than the hunting streams. And uh, we've been kind of stuck on the hunter, but we're going to start doing a little bit more fishing streams every now and then. I know everybody enjoys the hunter, but I do have people that enjoy the fishing part of it. I'm gonna try not to. This this feel like a pretty good fish now. Uh, it's pretty big uh, stout setup I've got here. I bought this rod and and reel setup. Uh, tackle point money. Yeah, a lot of people's that way. Uh, all right. Uh, a lot of people have never hunted in their life enjoy the hunting game uh, lots of people like that <clears throat> they love to play it but they never hunted and that's okay uh, you know uh, some people's just not into hunt and some people you know don't enjoy going and killing an animal but they enjoy killing a, a graphic so each to their own and I support everybody. That is not a catfish. That is a carp. <clears throat> I was afraid of that. <clears throat> Big old mirror carp. <clears throat> Let's get this back out here. If we don't hang into a catfish pretty quick we're going to journey on down the river yeah they got some uh, good looking carp on this game nice pretty fish I'm gonna take a second look at this map I can figure out that dead burn bridge is at I about blind this bat at distance. Unless I'm looking through them I mean it close up unless I'm looking through them bifocals.
Yeah. Uh. I turkey hunted one time and uh, I, I wanted to do it uh, and uh, I uh, called a turkey in the first time, killed a turkey. And, uh, but uh, never did do it again. I, I am uh, <clears throat> did much care for the wild turkey uh, meat it may be in way I prepared it <clears throat> I'm not much on shooting animal if I'm not going to use it for nourishment so I never did hunt again <clears throat> We've been here 20 minutes and we have no fish. So we are gonna head on down here. Yeah, and they smell when you clean them too. Uh, at least the ones that I've messed with had. We're gonna head up to this channel here. Yeah, that's a big thing out here, the uh, hogs. I'm gonna try it in a little shallower water right here for a few minutes. Let's see. We'll just kind of move around till we find something. Uh, <clears throat> that's a. Yeah, them holes is a real problem here. Uh, they really do destroy a lot of uh, agriculture. Hay meadows, especially, and uh, that hit the bottom, so we want to tighten that up just a little bit. Okay, we're gonna try it here. I don't know. I've never fished right here before. Thank you, Mike. Appreciate you always. Sharing me out and supporting me, uh, supporting me rather. Uh, appreciate that. <clears throat> Mike, I need to go back and watch your a video uh, that you put out on that uh, on those uh, <clears throat> comments. Every time I do a video here lately, I'm getting these foreign uh, language comments when I translate them they're usually um, something we don't want on our page so I need to go back and figure out how to block that cut that type of stuff out from getting on there I did a live last week and had three of them or Tuesday and had three and then I put a 40 second video of 40 minute video rather and had comments on that I'm like really uh, should I um, 
And somebody knows the answer to this. When I get comments from people like that, should I block those? I've been hiding, deleting the comments and hiding the comments, but should I block those people? Yeah. I would say they advertise their uh, stuff elsewhere. <clears throat> Report them. Okay, I'll start doing that. Uh, I'm still learning, so. I hate that uh, type stuff popping up. <clears throat> I get done here with the stream today. I got to help my wife get ready to <coughs> go on her trip. She leaves tonight. And my brother will be here to stay a couple of nights with me. He probably going to be ready to get rid of me come Sunday. Let me know if it clears up. Did it clear up? <clears throat> yeah, I don't know what that was about. Uh, just know that for future references, if that happens and I do get disconnected or lose you guys, I'll just pop up another stream. So I'll be right back on if that ever happens. We're going to have game day regardless. We are hooked up. I believe this is going to be on the whole roach. Somebody give me a thumbs up or something from back. Good. Thank you, Dale. Might have been my internet cut out for a second. Appreciate it, Steve. It's a catfish, folks. Give you all a look at him. I hear the 30-pound channel cat. I got another rod going off, so... It's going to be on the catfish pellet. We're hooked up. Uh -uh. Uh, hopefully I'll catch whales today. Uh, I caught one last time I played this bap. Uh, a nice green one. Really green spots all over it. Really nice looking fish. 
This fish is pulling, now I'm fixing to tell you. This may be a carp. He's... He ain't budging much. Hello, Matt. Appreciate you coming by, my friend. I want to remind everybody, uh, <clears throat> while we're working on this fish, <clears throat> about Thursday night shows tonight, uh, Fields to Water comes on at 7 at the bait shop. Chad has made the 1K mark. Congratulations, Chad. Well deserved. Uh, should have been uh, monetized a long time ago on his old channel fishing with Chad kind of got a little bit of a raw deal but he's back to the 1k mark and uh, we need to go tonight celebrate with him for getting back where he deserves well deserved my friend <clears throat> also we have uh, uh, yes long overdue you are correct sir uh, also, we have uh, Panfish Nation tonight, and uh, at eight Central, uh, I got another fish on that uh, <clears throat> number two rod up there, and there's there's Miss Jody, and I was just fixing to call her show out. We have Pontoon Jody's Catfish Challenge tonight. I'll probably catch some flack over this, but it's my favorite Thursday night show. <laughs> going to be a good night. Get your popcorn ready, folks. It's going to be a lot of fun. Let's see if we can get this fish here landed. And we got another one out there running all over the place. It's a big old catfish, too. Oh, that's a big old carp. Now you ain't supposed to bite that. Give y'all a quick look at him. <clears throat> Get this rod here picked up. We had a triple header there, folks. Rod on each pole. A fish on each pole. Lord, I said rod. <coughs> <coughs> I would imagine I'll get to hang in there pretty late tonight and watch Jody's show. My brother will be here. And <clears throat> Ain't no telling what we'll be doing tonight. This fish is good fish too. He's running. <clears throat> I ain't gaining much ground on him. He must be a pretty good sized boy. Watch that drag. Hello, Nick. Thanks for coming in, sir. How you doing today? Miss Jody, are y'all filled up for tonight? Mm -mm. I got him turned in the right direction. <laughs> Let's see if we can get him in the boat. Fight time on this is pretty well consistent with getting a big fish on. Go 
don't know what he is yet. I haven't got to see him. Maybe we'll break the water in a minute. Like I need to remember this spot. It's a pretty good spot so far. Here we go. I think it's a catfish. Yeah, it's a big old catfish. Ah, come on. Come back here. Big old channel cat. 38 pounds. That'll make some nice <clears throat> thumbnail graphics. I cut that out for the next stream. All right, let's cast these rods back out. Good deal. Uh, I don't know if uh, if y'all ever watched any YouTube videos about the Ibu River. Uh, they have some monster catfish come out of that river. Uh, this is uh, the uh, rendition of the portion that runs through the country of Spain. There are some monster fish that come out of that river system. Uh, they have <clears throat> several YouTube videos about it. It's a good watch. Uh, if you hadn't checked that out, catfish in other countries, you should. Pork chop. Hey, tonight's all about the. <coughs> The Barney suit, huh? <coughs> Danny Stone. How are you gonna let Fonz catch a fish tonight, Jody? All right, let's put this. <coughs> Bod rod back out there see if we can't get them going again. That's pretty fun getting in <coughs> three at a time. Good grief. May have to call the doctor and get her to give me some cough syrup. <clears throat> I've been taking Nyquil. Nyquil. That helps, but... Nice scenery. A lot of the river banks that you see on videos of this river is a lot like this. Uh, they have uh, <coughs> they have whales catfish in the Ibu River and they're in this game as well. Hopefully I catch one today. Show y'all one. Probably my favorite fish to catch on this <clears throat> platform because they're not easy to catch. You really have to kind of kind of a prize. On his own boat. Okay. Good 
your boy Troy's going to be on it too, huh? Pretty good crowd. I keep throwing this spot rod, that'll draw one in. They call this a pack bait. It looks like chicken feed to me, but oh, there's a fish. That's on the whole roach. Oh, I got one on the rod too as well. Here we go again. <laughs> that was nice, wasn't it? Hey, uh, uh, um, that flathead that you put on my real and virtual outdoors group page today, uh, when did you catch that? I don't like this fish very big, folks. Small channel cat. Just an 11 pounder. Let's get this one in. <clears throat> Maybe he'll be a. This is on the whole mackerel. <clears throat> if we're going to catch whales, it's going to be on rod two or three, most likely. I've never caught a whales on the pellets, but. J-Dog. Thank you, J-Dog, for coming in. Appreciate you. We are river catfishing today on the Ebu, a rendition of the Ebu River in Spain. Now, he wasn't supposed to buy that. That is a Xander. That's not what that bait was out there for. I think this rod here had a bite. It did. I picked that up and moved it. It was over here. Get out there and catch me a fish. <clears throat> Get them back out there. Yeah, uh, I'm getting better at editing videos. I'm I'm sort of learning now how to. get better at adding extra text and some graphics and things. Uh, double hook rigs. 
You may stay hung up on its worth. Let's see. What you gonna do if you get two flatheads on the same pole? Uh, I'm trying to learn to edit better, but uh, I'm learning a lot of things. CBA, hello, sir. Thank you for coming in. Uh, a lot of times I uh, <clears throat> I didn't even know how to make videos. Rather, when I started this YouTube channel seven months ago I never made a uh, edited video on a computer in my life until then but I was able to uh, learn and I'm getting better at it all the time so I got some learning some new tricks and graphics and uh, there goes the catfish pellets <clears throat> We're on. So I'm learning. Uh, and of course, I'm using a a free program too, so <clears throat> it doesn't have all the bells and whistles. But I'm gonna, I'm, <coughs> excuse me, limited on my stuff. Uh, I got an old laptop, but that's gonna get replaced here pretty quick. I've been looking for a um, looking at gaming computers. Try to decide which one I'm gonna buy. <clears throat> what I wanted to give for one is not gonna be what I end up giving for one, I'm afraid, because I want something not only can play games but got enough processing speed to stream games and uh, record and cut videos and so there's the channel cat lots of channel cats today <clears throat> have some real dark channel cats I've caught out of here black well, maybe we'll see one of those today but I'm working on learning to do better editing. A lot of the videos that I make uh, here lately, I met <clears throat> hello, Great Farmer. Great Farmer is one of the people that wanted to see this stream today. Appreciate you coming in, sir. Uh, <clears throat> I uh trying to learn how to you know do better but a lot of strength a lot of the videos that I make uh, here lately have been cut from streams and interesting things have happened in the hunters every once in a while you get a couple of glitches and they're kind of funny or uh, something funny happens or just makes for a nice video I go back and download and cut and make little shorts out of them. A whole micro zone. Yeah, I won't be <laughs> I won't be letting my rent go to uh buy one. Hello bug man. You're very welcome, sir. I always, uh, if a subscriber asks me to do a certain video, I always try to do it. I would prefer y'all tell me what you want. It makes it easier on me. I've said this before. It's kind of like having to decide what to cook every day. 
She starts when somebody else tells you what they want. <clears throat> Makes it easy on me. I didn't have to put a lot of thought into it. I spent my time yesterday editing videos. I got on here for five minutes, set the game up, so all I had to do is jump in the boat and get ready to go and make a thumbnail. And I was ready to rock and roll. Now you ain't supposed to bite that. Now you're hindering my catfish. There's another Xander. We're gonna fish here a little while longer if them dudes come up in here. We're moving. That's like <clears throat> catching bullhead when you're trying to catch blue cats and flatheads. <clears throat> so I'm going to ask uh, y'all's opinion on something. Well, I've got 12 people in here. <clears throat> How would y'all feel about seeing a game called Flight Simulator. And basically what it is, it's, a, it's an airplane game with very good graphics uh, and beautiful scenery. Uh, uh, basically you fly a plane over these beautiful sceneries a hundred times better than what you see on this. Uh, how would everybody feel about that, me playing that every once in a while? That's something I'll be able to do on the computer. Just fly around, look at stuff, and chat. It won't be something I play all the time, but it might make an appearance once or twice a month. Yep, thank you, Matt. I think y'all enjoy it. I, I, I looked at, uh, yeah, yeah, and you have an old version of it. <coughs> My wife seems to think it, that it would be a good stream, so <coughs> we may give that a try. Maybe I won't crash this up. I'll have to learn to fly the darn thing first. Got a fish on. Let me get this. <clears throat> Can you check out places where us viewers live? <clears throat> I don't know which maps they offer. Uh, I'm assuming it's probably destination driven. Like, I know that. New York and uh, Australia is on there, so I don't know what. Well, I don't know what's all on there. I do know that they have multiple maps to buy and download. So it depends on where you live. Correct. That is correct. He can fly just about anything on there, and they're also going to have a. Uh, I seen yesterday they made one for Top Gun Maverick, so there's going to be a fighter jet in there for long. I don't know what's all that entails, but yep. Yeah. There's an eel. Alright. Let's uh let's move down a little ways. It's kind of an opening right up here. We're gonna try this. It's 
for deep water right here. We're gonna we're gonna give this a shot for a few minutes. Uh, yes. Also, uh, I guess you're gonna be flying off of an aircraft carrier if you have the uh, Top Gun Maverick. I'll be lucky if I can land the plane. Uh, much less land on the ship. Yeah, the graphics pretty good here. Uh, but <clears throat> on that flight simulator, they're going to be a lot better graphics because it's running on a... That's a deep, deep spot right there, folks. We're going to try it right here and see what happens. It's running on a lot uh, faster platform so they can, you know, really juice the graphics up. The computer I got now won't play it. <laughs> It'd be like, really? But. You know, some of these gaming computers is extremely high. I, I've looked at some between three and five thousand dollars. I won't be paying that for one, but I really wanted to try to get a get one for around seven. I don't think it's going to happen. I think I'm going to be somewhere in the neighborhood of a thousand to thirteen hundred. <clears throat> That's a lot of money for a But my wife's like, why buy something when you could say, you know, for something a little less and when you could buy what you really want? She's right. When it comes to that type of stuff. Yeah, they did a pretty good job on this. Yes, it is. It's very real world. We're going to see, it's going to be my prediction that we're going to see, um, in the next 10 years, we're going to see an evolution of these games. It's going to be unbelievable. Uh, yeah. It is. Uh, from what I see. And it may take me a long it may take me a little while to, to learn it. Uh, I appreciate it. Appreciate it, the hunter. Uh, I think I've seen you in Lady Legends chats before. Appreciate you coming by. Appreciate the support. Yes, I have. Well, I need to go talk to somebody, and uh, Matt, in reference to that, I need to go talk to somebody that's a lot smarter than I am uh, about what I need. Uh, <clears throat> Let's just don't know a whole lot about the computers. I mean, and I really don't, <coughs> excuse me, I really don't know anything about the Xboxes either much. I've had to, uh, I've had to uh, uh, kind of learn the ins and outs of it. Thank you, sir. I appreciate it. You have a good evening. Sleep well. <coughs> I 
I think I've seen that uh, the Hunter and Lady Legends chat many times. <clears throat> you know a guy? Yeah. Uh, Polar Bear knows a guy too. I, I may have to get a little in touch with y'all, get a little guidance about what I need to do. Uh, and if I'm going to buy something, I want to do it right. I don't want to, you know. <clears throat> Now, y'all getting a little personal now. <laughs> yeah, I've already been looking. Yeah, I've seen you there before. I think you've, I think I've seen you in uh, KC Planets also. I watch those streams a lot. I watch them on TV. Uh, Hunter. So, I, I get into chat every once in a while. <clears throat> Chat's usually flying so fast, and you, know, you can't hardly read it. Uh, I like the way Casey's got it on slow mode, where he can kind of interact more. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I've seen you there before. I enjoy I enjoy his content very much. KC Planet's got some good stuff going on right well <clears throat> I've been looking at them on the computer I looked at one that was like seven <clears throat> I have reached out to Lady Legend she does not know me but I have reached out to her on her discord and asked the question because she does a lot of gaming on the computer about what uh, she would suggest and I plan on reaching out to Casey Planet as well uh, he knows who I am. I've been in his chat several times, but <clears throat> and asked him for a little uh, suggestion, maybe. But I want to get something that's good. Uh, I'm going to drop the money on it. Now I looked at one; it was like 700. <clears throat> but uh, when you look at the uh, gigabytes of storage. Uh, it was like 500 gigabytes. Well, <clears throat> these computer games take a lot of gigs. So I'm, I, I want something in the terabyte, at least one terabyte of storage. <clears throat> yeah, I don't figure I'm going to get anything less than 1200. It's going to be worth anything. So after researching. <clears throat> We're going to get the Xbox first. Uh, <clears throat> that way I can play with some friends. and uh, <clears throat> Appreciate that. Uh, I'm going to get the Xbox first. And... Uh, <clears throat> So I can play some multiplayer games uh, with some folks. Uh, you cannot stream on Xbox unless you do it through a computer, to my knowledge. I have not. I, I think that is correct. There may be a way. Uh, I don't know anything. You have to have a caption card. I don't know anything about that. But uh, I know you can do it with a capture card, so. I would be grateful for you to do that, uh, Hunter. Uh, yes, uh, that would be that would be great. Uh, I'd like to maybe get a suggestion from him about uh, what uh, he thinks I need to uh, play some of the games that he's playing, especially the Hunter uh, and uh, some of these top fishing games. I don't play a lot of war games and things. I'm not into that. Uh, I don't know. I think I am. If I'm not, I will be on there after this stream's over with. I'll get on there. And I have Discord. I don't know if he's if I've joined his Discord yet, but I have Discord platform. So I 
I'm working on it. Yes, and that's what I'm doing right now. <clears throat> I'm not recording because uh, I'm already recording. <laughs> uh, I have a uh, real and virtual outdoors group page. You can uh, instant message me there. My email address is my about page on my YouTube channel, and so is the link to my Facebook page. So, that's how you can contact me, Hunter. Well, okay, so on rod one, I have <clears throat> catfish pellets, that's what they call it, it looks like stink bait. On rod two there in the middle, I have uh, a whole mackerel and a whole roach on rod three. So, 12 foot rods, 40 pound braid, number two hooks. Well, it's something I, I I will enjoy to play uh, froggy and it'll you know, put on a good show uh, too. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm just um, I'm just working off of a uh, PlayStation uh, Farmer, and I uh, like I said, I don't bother to record while I'm streaming because. Basically, I'm already recording. I can go back and download the stream after it's over with and cut videos out of it. <clears throat> I'm getting a little faster at it all the time. We'll fish here a few minutes. If they don't start, we're going to move. <clears throat> I wish that cough would go somewhere. I gotta tell you, I, that's nagging. <clears throat> All right. <clears throat> I'm gonna fast travel back up here. Y'all don't have to listen to that boat ride the whole way. <clears throat> We're gonna go down this way a little while. This boat is pitiful. <laughs> Ooh, I just run over a bunch of fish. folks we're gonna stop right here for a while I just run over a whole pile of fish see what happens gravel bottom right here. <clears throat> I am the only mod and dropping links is for my please go into my channel I 
I am the only mod. Uh, are you saying that you uh, are you saying that you are the only moderator in here and you don't drop links so you're saying that you shouldn't have a ranch is that what you're saying to me if that's the case let me let me say this to you or do you not have a ranch if you're saying that you don't drop links and you don't need you don't deserve a wrench, let me let me say this. You have if you have I gave you a wrench because I trust your judgment. If somebody comes in here and acts silly that you'll take care of it. So elaborate a little more about what you're saying. I'm gonna have to change these hooks because we're on a different bottom here, so let me do that real quick. Oh, sorry, I didn't see that. Oh, I got you now. Okay. You have a wrench, so right, Froggy? Thank you, sir. I appreciate you coming in. Good to see you. You don't have a ranch art? Uh, I'm sorry, I, I, uh, you should have a ranch. All he's got to do is just go to my about page. Uh, on real and virtual outdoors and the uh, link is at the top right hand of the page you can click on it and Arch you'll have a wrench I, for some reason now I want you to have one <laughs> it's a worry to me because I need somebody looking after me because I get these crazies that stuff that comes in here that we don't want on our YouTube uh, <clears throat> for some reason, uh, that thing's, when I go to give somebody a wrench, it, sometimes it's kind of squirrely. I put the link in, but it don't, it don't accept it. I had a hard time giving Jody a wrench at one time, and Froggy too. <clears throat> it didn't want to accept the, what I was, well, that paid off. It did want to accept it for some reason, but I finally got it to work. I had to go back and do uh, froggies the next day because it wouldn't do it. It may be my computer is old. Uh, I don't do very much stuff on the phone. Thank you, Polar Bear. Appreciate that. Uh, I don't do much on the phone way my hands are it's just hard for me to do it on the phone I try to stay away from doing anything on the phone my little fat crooked fingers don't work too good on the phone there's a catfish So, I had to change hooks. You have uh, hooks for setups for different type of bottoms. I was fishing in silt, and this spot's gravel, so we had to change the hooks. Oh, 
Okay. I'll have to do that on the YouTube side. Yes. Uh, you're right. Okay. I, I'll do that. Because I want you to have one. Uh, I don't have a whole lot of wrenches given out, but people that I do have one, I know I can rely on if somebody comes in misbehaving with some kind of trash or something. <laughs> yeah, you asked for a froggy and you got a polar bear. Yeah, polar bear, did, uh, did you uh, look up the wobbly captain? I sent you a reply to the email. Yeah, I'm a pretty handsome dude, ain't I, Froggy? Uh, I'm getting a bite. Uh oh. Ah, this one right here is getting kind of squirrely. Uh -uh. I'm same way, Chad. But we're learning. I don't know if y'all heard that or not. I just had a fish on the other line and it come off. Yeah. That's really the best way, Chad, to learn how to play that game because you're right, those tutorials are not much help. Chad bought uh, Bass Masters 2022 and sent me an email for everybody so you know what we're talking about. The tutorial was terrible. They didn't teach you much. So I gave him some people to watch to learn how to play. Okay, I got a fish on rod one as well. This is another channel. That's a fat boy there. Thirty-eight pounds. <clears throat> so I had a fish on rod two and it come off, so we'll have to recast that. Uh, okay. Um, you're on Xbox, right? I think if it's the same, it's the R1. On top of the control. So what I did, instead of spending a bunch of time looking at tutorials, what I did is I just looked up Bass Masters 2022 Xbox controls. And it will give you a, a list to show you all that stuff. This fish right here is pulling. Yeah. There's two buttons on top of the control. I think it's I think it's the one in the front. Whatever Xbox calls that. Ashley Brady. How are you, Ashley? Thank you for coming in. Good to see you. Hello, Miss Jody. <clears throat> glad you glad to have you, Ashley. Um we might do a stream. Don't hold me to this. We might do a stream one night this week. And if my brother wants to do it, uh, or wants to watch me do it, he's kind of shy. He may not want to be on camera. Uh, and he's kind of shy until you get to know him, and then he's, he's all right then. But 
we just might do a <clears throat> we might do a Friday or a Saturday night live stream just for fun I have not done one on the weekend at night <clears throat> Jody is the Flathead Queen. You are correct. The proof is in the pictures. And she's got quite a few of them. <clears throat> I plan on setting up late tonight. I may be in chat tonight, Jody. If I don't go to hurting, I'll probably... He's going to be here watching. We're going to be talking and carrying on. I may... If I'm not in pain from sitting in a wheelchair, I may get come on into chat tonight for a little while. But if I don't, I'm watching. <clears throat> Bite's pretty good right here, folks. So now, the the million dollar question is is why is why is the bike good right here? Well, everybody said, well, it's the location, but we've had a change of bottom too. We went from silt bottom to gravel bottom, and that does make a difference sometime on this game. <clears throat> Here's one of those Xanders again. Nice looking fish, but he's not what we're looking for. Good Lord, you see them clouds disappear? I mean, they just disappeared on them once. <laughs> That's funny. Oh my. They could have just dried up and left. Everybody that's in here now, at least in all announcements, again, fields to water made 1K mark. Uh, so, everybody's got a little time this evening to go over to the bait shop and congratulate those people. They're good people, and it's well deserving that he's back to 1K. He should have been monetized a long time ago. Very happy for Chad and Miss D. Don R. Hello, Don. Glad to see you, sir. I hadn't seen you in chat much, Don. You must be awful busy here lately. I really do enjoy this game. I wish they hadn't give up on it so fast. I wish they still had some content coming out for it. It's a lot of fun. I just enjoy catching a catfish on it. 
That's on the whole roach. 26 pounds. Got to keep an eye on them other two rods. <clears throat> Mm -hmm. I hadn't seen much Don and Chad. He, he must have been kind of busy. <clears throat> or I've been missing him, one of the two. <clears throat> I watched uh, Half Century Half Century show this morning. Uh, he's taking over Tuesdays and Thursday night for uh, Hog Lake. Hawkeye decided to do his show on Monday, Wednesdays, and Fridays, and Half Century stepped up, took Tuesdays and Thursdays. <clears throat> they have uh, whales cat, uh, whales catfish. I may pronounce that wrong. I try to say whales. It's not whale. It's whales catfish. Uh, but my country tongue will not allow me to say it correctly. W e l s, and. Uh, they're big. And I love to catch those uh, out of here. You don't always catch one. They're kind of a prize to catch one. I was hoping we'd catch one on today's stream, but lots of fun on those. We have been pushing the dovetail games. There's, you know, they made three. This will be the fourth fishing game. They, uh, they made four fishing games now. This is the third out of four. But uh, we've been kind of pushing them in the direction of making us a catfish game. There's a lot of people that love to catfish, and uh, I would certainly buy it immediately. Uh, We'd have some good catfishing in it. <clears throat> but it's like everything else, it has to be financially feasible. <laughs> Froggy. <laughs> I looked at purchasing the catfish bundle uh, I have the Fisher Pun fishing planet I looked at purchasing the catfish bundle it's about $30 I'm gonna wait till it goes down on sale and I'll probably purchase that and then we might do a catfish stream on fishing planet uh, but I need the right gear to do it with, or it's gonna not be a good stream. Ernie Brown is back. Are we still here? We're gonna be here for another 30 minutes, <clears throat> or unless I start coughing up a lung. Froggy said the kitchen is closed. That's just a Xander. We're going to get off that quick. Because <clears throat> Rod 1 has got a fish on it. This is on the catfish pellets. Well, bite's happening fast and furious now, isn't it? I want to say thank you to the people that are watching the background. There's a lot of people that watch in the background. I appreciate you watching. I'd invite you to come in the chat sometime and 
get to know some of these good people and uh but I appreciate your support. I get a lot of views in the background and quite a few on after the fact. Uh, so I'm grateful for y'all as well. If you're not a subscriber to Real and Virtual Outdoors, I ask that you subscribe. We have game day on Tuesdays and Thursdays. Then I do the Fish at Pond, which is a talk show on Monday night. You might hear a little something about educational stuff on there now and then, but basically it's a Monday night is a place for the community to gather and share their thoughts and what's going on with their channel and whether they're catching any fish or not. I need a, a headset for the game and a hard drive. <clears throat> Is your hard drive full? If your hard drive's full and you're not playing some stuff, take some stuff off of it. <clears throat> you ought to be able to buy a headset for cheap. Uh, if you just, that's a carp. <clears throat> Uh, yeah. Uh, <clears throat> you probably find your headset pretty cheap. Thank you, sir. I didn't buy. I bought a. When I bought my headset, I, they were kind of expensive. I think. Well, my wife got them for me. I think they were like a hundred. But I bought a good quality pair because I knew I was going to be doing streams all the time. I wanted something with some good sound quality that y'all could hear me good and that I didn't have to yell. And I talk in a very low voice. Uh. And when I listen to the streams, and I do go back and watch, because uh, I do learn stuff, and uh, it always sounds very clear and good. Pretty tats got to eat too, Froggy. I thought you just got done telling us the kitchen was closed. <clears throat> that means it's closed to some, but not all, huh? The head frog can go to the kitchen. <laughs> You know, talking about eating late, when I was a young man, I could eat just about anything I wanted and then go to bed. Not anymore. Oh, only the appliances. I got you. I, uh, I can't eat much stuff and go to bed now or I pay the price indigestion never had indigestion when I was young I could eat a jalapeno double meat cheeseburger and chili cheese fries and go lay down and sleep like a a hibernating bear if I do that now I'd be up half the night Come on here. I think it's another carp.
No, it can't be. He's a little bit lighter and got a little bit more spots on him. It's a pretty good spot right here. We're going to keep riding this till the wheels fall off of it. And maybe we can drag up the wheels here in a minute. <clears throat> Cheese and onion chips. I'm going to have cabbage roll tonight with red sauce and ground turkey meat with rice, onions. My wife fixes it. It's very good. And yep, I'm eating turkey meat in place of ground beef. Because I'm trying to lose weight. And I got to tell you, I do not mind eating turkey meat one little bit. It's very good. <clears throat> and a big old cup of field peas tonight. You didn't have no dinner last night. Good grief. Yeah, she fixes it. It's really good. And it's really low calorie, too. So I, we kind of keep the rice to a minimal and what we put in it. Really filling and really good. And I can have a nice big portion without having to worry about the calories too much. Oh, you went to bed early? I, I go to bed early, too, but I sure ain't going to go without eating. Some old man outdoors. Hello, sir. Thank you for coming in. Glad to have you, sir. Glad to have everybody. Been a good stream. I love chatting with y'all on Tuesdays and Thursdays. I look forward to it. And Polar Bear is going to have to hook up and get on the same lake when I get that Xbox and go catch some bass together. That ought to be fine. You know, uh, I'm going to have to learn the controls on the Xbox too, Chad. It's going to be different than what it is on PlayStation. I'll have to learn all that stuff. Rod 2's got a bite. That's the whole mackerel. And we are on. Uh, uh, that thing goes on sale quite a bit. Uh... It won't matter that much. Ten dollars here it won't matter that much. What if I? I'm not gonna wait for every get it save a little bit. How much you pay for it? Uh, I'm worried around a long time. Yeah, I'm gonna get one too. I'm I'm working at it. Really? Yeah, you did get it cheap. 
So, here's a question for you, Chad. Should I get, I get the uh, digital, or should I get one that plays discs? Because I got to tell you, uh, I have very few discs for the PlayStation. I do all, I, I usually buy from the store and download. So should I just get the digital, or what do you think? This game is also on Xbox. I found it. I've been looking around on the website. Get to digital. Okay, that's what I want to know. <clears throat> I think the digital is one terabyte, so. I think. The digital is actually a little cheaper. It's 169. I don't like the pain strange putting disc in and out. I got a fish on rod one too. This is not a wheels. This is a channel. Thirty four pounds. <coughs> this is on the uh, catfish pellet. So this probably Will not be a whales, but we're going to bring him in to see. I will get, uh, what I plan to buy is a uh, fishing sim world. That's what Aaron and Kelly Bullock play. Bass Masters 2022. And then probably the hunter. Uh, <clears throat> especially if Ernie's playing it. We can get on there and play a little bit. Now this is a carp. This is a carp. Now. Right. Now I'm. I don't. I got a DVD player for that. PlayStation 2. It plays movies. I don't need the Xbox to do it too. I watch a lot of my stuff digitally anyway. All my uh, TV and Netflix and everything, it's all digital. Eighty six degrees, good grief. <clears throat> well, we've had some ridiculous heat here. Uh, hadn't even been outside much, it's too hot. Too hot. Yeah, it's just too hot. It's, it's been hot here, too. Ridiculous. <clears throat> I finally get things straightened out well enough where I can go fishing and do a few things. And now it's got the dog on hot. I, I can't say that on that dock in 105 degree weather. I'd be sick. Ain't no way. There's going to be some fishing right here on this video game. Until it cools off and that's going to be it.
That is an ugly boat. I'm not going to say whose boat that looks like. Yeah, I, well, I mean, I, I, if I go fishing, it's going to be really early, and I'll quit early because it's too hot. Now, heat waves cause a lot of problems. Uh, Froggy, we got it over here, too, and that excessive heat has belted a bunch of snow up in the mountains. And Yellowstone Park has <laughs> got a raging river flooding everything, tearing everything up. Uh, had to run a tourist out of there because it's so dangerous. A bunch of houses washed down the river and everything else. There's a dark one. I've seen them. I've seen them dark, darker black than that. Yeah, I won't see that until October, below 80. <laughs> it ain't gonna happen. We didn't really have spring here. It just got hot. Come on, well, catfish. Sure wanted to catch one for y'all today. We'll have to do this again. Everybody enjoyed this, I hope. <clears throat> we hadn't played Bass Bastards in a while. We'll have to play it some, too. Tuesday, I plan on doing the Hunter. <clears throat> but uh, if I get a suggestion... That intercepts that. I will uh, take the first person that says do this and we'll run with it. So, there's the catfish pellets again. <clears throat> I have this fish game and uh, fish and sim world, and I also have. Well, <clears throat> let me let me finish my my deal here. Uh, and uh, somebody has something to uh, request, I'll do that for them on Tuesday. Okay, so Chad, this is the rule I like to follow. Uh, I try to buy a little of each <clears throat> instead of concentrating on one particular thing like soft plastics. Uh, I will buy maybe a soft plastic uh, or a hard bait. Uh, so start out with your start out with your rattle traps, and then uh, that's where you should start. Start with your rattle traps. You get your crank baits later because a lot of these lakes are shallow, and uh, get you some soft plastics and a couple of spinners, and that ought to be a good start for you. Rattle traps bait and a few soft plastics if you're just fishing for bass now if you're trying to catch crappies things like that you want to buy the Ned Bomb uh, the orange fry daddy I think the green one's free or the orange tea fry daddy <coughs> and uh, but the uh, the rattle traps, spinner baits, and uh, 
a few plastics seem to work the best. And uh, the spoons. Spoons catch just about anything. That's what you need to buy first. Uh, then rattle traps. Spoon catches all varieties. Uh, and those fish make you money. And the more money you make, the more lures you can buy. There is a carp. That is a mirror carp. Yeah. Nice looking sky, isn't it? I catch a lot of my fish on that game, Chad, on spoons. Uh, that's kind of what I start out with as a rule. Thank you, thank you, thank you. This is probably one of my favorite places, just to throw out lines and fish, because <clears throat> catch a lot of channels and always holding your breath for a whales. I could catch more carp by using more carp bait, but I have all kind of boilies and flavors and but we're after catfish today specifically, so two and three is not gonna catch any carp. Catfish pellets do catch them, as you see. Are you going to cover? Uh, uh, you going to fish in a covered? Is that what you're saying? You're going to fish in a covered dock? That's somewhere new. Is that somewhere new you're going? Spoons, uh, and fishing in real life spoons is probably the most, in my opinion, probably the most versatile lure you can uh, use. <clears throat> Are you going to be fishing for crappie, Chad? Uh, <clears throat> spoons is probably the most versatile lure you can use. You can cast them, you can troll them, you can jig them, and they do catch a very wide variety of fish. They'll catch same spoons that I use here to catch bass and white bass and even crappies will catch ocean fish. Uh, it's hard to go wrong with a spoon. doing some tied jigs I need to send you some jigs to try we're gonna have a jig tying uh, live 
on the fishing pond one Monday night. I was going to do it next Monday. Uh, I think that's, we're probably going to have to put it off a week. Uh, I have a tentatively uh, uh, possible guest for not this Monday, but next Monday night for the to come on the fishing pond. So we'll see if that works out. <clears throat> I buy, um, I don't know what what it's like in the UK, uh, but I buy stuff off eBay, and a lot of times I can find uh, spoons pretty cheap uh, in bulk. I know they can be kind of high to buy. Uh, you can also find some on Amazon. Uh, Usually those things over here in the states cost about four bucks a piece. Uh, <clears throat> I bought eighty of them for forty bucks. Uh, I mean, uh, forty of them for forty bucks. I bought two different sizes of forty. I got a good price on those. Worked just as well as the four dollar ones. <clears throat> Give you another little tip about spoons. Uh, you take a bottle of fingernail polish, paint one side of that spoon, or not even the whole side, just paint a line down the middle of it, changes the bait totally uh, to a flash a lot of color as it rotates and falls, and can really make it just a just a bright streak of color down the middle of one of them or one side totally change a fish's attitude towards it sometimes uh, blue is a favorite here I use a metallic blue fingernail polish and paint it stays on well cheap to apply when it starts to get chipped or come off like fingernails often will I just paint it again yeah. <clears throat> I have a uh, a lure that I use in the summertime on crappies. It's a small spoon. It's about the size of a thumbnail. Uh, it's called a slender spoon. It's a very light spoon, about one sixteenth ounce. Same weight as the average G head. But it's only about an inch and a half long. I use that spoon. They'll bite that when they won't bite nothing else. Uh, as far as jigs. You have a good night, Froggy. Thanks for coming. Oh, I see. I, I misread that. Yeah. Uh, I be, I'm sorry. I misread that. I thought you was going. You saying that most of the lives you are late night. Yeah. little fingernail polish on, on one side of one of those spoons. Change it to a totally different lure. Uh. Works good. We got the two hour mark. We're gonna we're gonna fish for a few more minutes and then we're gonna shut her down for the day off. I don't like closing out too quick without saying goodbye to everybody and how much I appreciate you. We're gonna stay on for another five minutes and we're gonna close her out. <clears throat> uh a lot of times I'll color a spoon and it makes a difference.
<laughs> yeah, it don't get dark over here till about ten o'clock. Uh, most nights. It's too uh, too late, in my opinion. I thank y'all for coming. I'm proud to do it. I enjoy doing it every Tuesday and Thursday. And like I said, we may we may do one weekend. I may be off schedule a little bit. He can be here. We may stay up a little later and piddle around. So Usually at night time, wife gets done working, we're having dinner, and then we have TV shows we want to watch, and talk, and whatever. Oh, here's the fish. It's a good way to wrap it up. We'll catch us one more, folks. A catfish pellets has been hot today. This is only catfish pellets. Well, you have a good day at work. I'm sorry about the gas, buying the gas. That's a mess, isn't it? Be safe. Thank you for coming, Steve. And I enjoyed your company as well. <clears throat> we're going to get this one fish in, this last fish in, and then we're going to close her out for the day. He's running. He's running big time. Come on back here. <clears throat> there you come. He's not very big. He just pitched it a fit. There's one that's a little more green. That is not a whale's. That is a channel. Halibut catfish pellet. Yeah, ain't that the truth, polar bear? Uh, I think I heard uh, Eric... Uh, fat boy Eric say he paid six dollars one day for his gas. That's ridiculous. <clears throat> but on to the on to something else. I appreciate y'all coming. <coughs> Hopefully next time I don't have this cough. And uh, I enjoyed y'all's company very much. $65 for three cans. Good night. <clears throat> Hopefully next week I won't have this cough, but even though I'm testing negative, it's still lingering. So, <clears throat> But I want to thank you all for coming. I enjoyed it. I hope you enjoyed the show. If anybody's got any suggestions about uh, what they might want to see on Tuesday, uh, drop me a, a uh, suggestion on uh, Real and Virtual Outdoors group page or send me an email. If you do, I will make a thumbnail and we'll do that. appreciate everybody that's... Yeah, I've heard it can last up a up to a month, Ernie, uh, after the fact. I hope not. About to drive me nuts. <clears throat> if you're not a subscriber and you're watching in the background and you enjoy the show, please subscribe and give me a thumbs up. Thanks to my Hello, friends, for being here and spending two hours with me. I love each and every one of you and enjoy your company. Everybody's been a part of this one. God bless you, and have a good day. We'll see you on Monday night on the Fishing Pond. <laughs>